Yay, they rejoined the party. Yay. It's not stuck as the stupid cat again. It's not stuck as what whoever. <laughs> So, it failed to record my recruited cat as a variable, so it didn't add the cat back in. Or as just a stored value. That's what I mean by a variable. Okay, I'm still line pop. Am I required to add a cat to my party? Maybe I am supposed to visit the sick cats right now. Just because of what Tiger Star was saying. If I go in there, will there actually be anybody? Nope, there's nobody. Okay. And that's upstairs. Nope. Where is everybody? It's the beanstalk, guys. Jack and the beanstalk. So what am I supposed to do right now? Let's just check. Stuck guy, oh, just cuz. Just cuz I can. Sky Oak, you've got anything? Doesn't seem like it. Sleep, 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 sleep. I th thought I was just sleeping all the time. Just last time. As Jay's wing. So. What's happening? Do I have any more cats to recruit? No more cats at this time. Let's just poke in here. Actually, I was just in here. Why am I doing that? Well, sleep, but still. Anyways, I'm just picking up my other recruit cat. If I'm supposed to be Jay's pal right now, I'm gonna visit the stick once again. Just because I got no response to whatever, I got no response to where to get herbs. Oh, herbs! That's probably what I need to do. Because I remember that line pod does indeed end up getting herbs. I'm guessing I'll be near the two leg nest. Okay. Guess not. S 
so just in case I'm supposed to be J Paul right now, I'm gonna check down here. Nope. None of that. So, I don't know what to do, so, remembering the last events with Holly Leaf, it was seeing Saul, Lion Blaze, it was see supposedly seeing Tiger Star talking about the sick cats and my power, and j Pod was the lake with the stick and all that plot so I checked the possible immediate plot lines with nine please and yeah so What to do, what to do. I just realized that Crowdtail is missing. Is he one of the sick cats? Let's check claws. No more claws. Claws as in C L O. Not O. U S E. I'm no city one. Cough, cough, cough. Cough, cough, cough. It's like a taunt now. It's like a taunt. Spider leg. You most certainly do need to go to the sick cats to the two regular nest. No, I'm completely fine. I just wish that every cat would stop fussing over me. I'm not sick. Just the continuous coughing. I just don't. Bother. Um, I'm sorry, but you most definitely are. The chains that I gave you will soothe your throat, and then you'll need to go to the two rig nest. I brought you this mouse for you to eat before you go to the nest, spider leg. I'm not hungry, and I'm not sick either. You should eat. Our kids worry about you. It's a wonder they remember you, really, seeing as you barely ever visit them. It's not like I'm not interested in them. I just think you do a better job at raising them. On your own. What? S Spider leg. Every kid deserves to know its father. If you're not careful, it'll be too late and you'll not know who you are. She cats. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Kids are a precious gift, really. You should have any every chance you can to be a good father. It's too much. It's so much better than being a mentor. And how would you know? S s sorry. It's just that I didn't intend to have kids with Daisy. I feel useless and clumsy around them, and I feel like every cat's judging me because I'm not closer to Daisy. That doesn't matter. Whatever happens or doesn't happen between you and Daisy, the cats still have a mother and a father. They won't judge you, and in the end, they're the only things that matter. I don't understand what to do. I can't... And just coughing. Well done. And you. And now you really need to go to the two egg nest. 
Lion Blaze, you should get out of here. You don't want to get sick too. And I see you appeared, so let's talk to you. Unless you're sick. Lion Blaze, just the cats I was looking for. I need to bring more prey to the cats. No too lateness. Could you do this for me, please? Yes, thank you. Great, thank you. So what prey do you need? Okay. I just fed a random cat. I don't know what prey I need. So that's good. I'm just going there. Just because I'm totally not supposed to get sick. And that's exactly what I could end up doing. You got the mouse. Think. Oh. Can I talk to you? I want my mother. Okay. Biostar is dying. He's losing a life. And that... You're not gonna tell me about the other cat that's already dead? I... No! Just walks away. Was that? <laughs> okay then. Everything's okay now. I'm better. Give him that mouse that Lion Blaze brought. Lion Blaze, you should leave. It isn't safe for you here. Firestar, are you going to die and come back again? I think I'm all right now. You aren't all right though. There are sick cats all around you. You should return to camp too. There's nothing Leafpool can do for me that can't be done here. I'll stay with all of you until you are recovered. Okay, just put pressure on them to get better. That's a great plan. There's nothing Leafpool can do for me that can't be done here. I question what that... The accuracy and what that statement actually means. Nine Blaze, what are you doing standing around? I don't know, we're still in a cutscene. You're going to have catch Green Cough too. So you all have Green Cough here? So those sake. Great. Everybody's got freaking Green Cough. I thought they just had white cough, and maybe a few have green cough, but not everybody here has green cough. Like, what? Go and tell the cats in camp and what happened. Well, and maybe bring us some catnip while you're at it. Quickly leave the sick cats. Okay. Are you asking for catnip? What are you still doing here? You have to go back to the camp and tell them what the news. The news. Okay. Well, let's go. Extra, extra, read all about it. Firestar died and came back and he's here now. So you probably already know about it. Well, look who decided to come back to camp. Your back and Firestar lost his life. No! You can you can help him, Sandstone, but he's okay now. You actually saw him die and come back. What did it look like? Barely knows. I expect I might expect a question like that from a kid. You're a full warrior and you should behave like one. This is horrible news. Imagine what will happen if we don't get catnip soon. Okay. So maybe now is when I talk to Jay. Paw, or maybe not, and maybe I talk to Leaf Pool first about the catnip, or maybe J Paw is with him. Firestar lost life. What do you want? Uh oh. I thought he was referring to that. Finally, you have some sense. It took us Lido losing a life to show you through. 
I'll explain what a catnip is. Go through the tunnels, come up an entrance near the right side near Windcran. The catnip is in a sort of grassy area near a stream of some rocks. Okay. So, tunnels come up near Windcran. Dream, rocks, catnip. Those are the notes I took in my mind. Let's save. So, we're now using this as a form of transportation. So that's good. Good to know. Good to know also. So I still have a basic feel of the tunnel. But I'm going to where I meet Heather Pool, not to the place where I jump across. Well, I'm supposed to I'm probably supposed to go to the place where I jump across. I wonder if he knows that by the dream. So maybe that was a two-in-one dream. He both got his question answered and got the solution. I'm no longer a determined warrior. What? Come on. I can still jump this gap. Like, both times I had a reason to jump across, so both times I should be able to jump across. But nope, only the, f the time in the Dark River and not this time. Was it the Dark River? Yeah, it was the Dark River. That it happened. I am still a determined warrior. A warrior that is determined. This path is completely opened up now. Let's go back and save. j Paul wasn't specific on where to exit, so... I have no idea where I'm going. Well, here's an exit. Let's see where this leads me. To a stream. And this is the place in the dream. Find a huge bundle of catnip. This is just what the sick cats need. You better use it wisely. So. Yay. I do not feel like talking to Heather Paul right now. Or Heather Tail. Is there another way out? There is this way out, but of course I can't take it. Ah. Uh. Thief, I saw you sneaking around those rocks. I figured you might try to steal herbs, and I was right. Why didn't you get a patrol then? You might think you're the best fighter in all the clans, but you don't scare me one bit. The cat appears that only you can see. So I was about to say, are you scared now? But it's only me. And I'm brave, she's a traitor. This is your chance. Kill her now. Do it. She ambushed your clan. She led with clan to the tunnel. Kill her. Make her pay. So. It says only I can see Tiger Star right now. So this means he's in spiritual form rather than physical form. So. That's not attack. Go away and don't come back. You can have your catnip, but just remember that I, But just because I don't want to see cats suffer. 
Just be make sure you don't end up like your Ken, Tiger Star. Um Okay. You made a mistake today, Lion Blaze. I won't be over forgetting it. I don't see them staking all on the Because the mystique would have to be from a tactical standpoint and not just because I didn't kill her and there was not much of a reason tactical wise that I would need to kill her I mean like really speaking of which why didn't Tiger Star visit me when I was with Toadfoot and we were discussing that if we don't trust them, we'd have to kill them. Why didn't he, Tiger Star take that chance to visit me and try to get me to kill someone? Tiger Star, you're slow on the trigger. So, to j -Paw, or to the Leap or whatever, unless I need to bring it to them. Um, j -Paw said you got catnip. He said I was getting catnip. Thanks, Stokran. I think that is all the catnip we need. I cannot thank you and your brother enough. You truly made, may just have saved our clan. Well, everybody's got green cough, so I would say so. And not a moment too soon. And hopefully not a moment too late. Okay. So. That wrapped this episode up. We got the catnip. To. Save the crayon from. Green cough. So. Yay. So. See you guys next time, and bye.